Regrettably, we lost Komla a yes. few years ago, who had not only become a huge asset to Ghana, but also to the African continent. Yes. How has it been since his passing? Can I ever say how it feels? Almost every day, almost every day, tears don't show, but the crying still goes on. And I make it a duty every morning to visit their tombs. My late wife and Komla, they are in the same place behind my window. So I go there and say a little prayer and commit them to the bosom of the Lord and ask them to intercede for those of us who are still alive so that the memory will still continue. If you come into my house and you come into the living room, I have the picture of my late wife and Komla staring me everywhere. But mind you, whilst I was doing the public service for NIA, I lost my wife. I lost my older sister. Six months after my wife had passed away. I lost my younger sister six months after the older sister had passed away. And about four years later, Komla also passed away. So that is a price that I have to pay. But there is joy in that suffering. Because I know that they were good. They did everything to serve this country. 